I'm pretty sure I got glitter in this eye. Of course, this happens to me right when I start recording. I'm just gonna pretend it's not there, I guess. No, that's not gonna work. But I also can't wash it out because I got makeup on. Well, this is an interesting start to a horror commentary. Welcome back! What's up guys, it's Ange, and today we're gonna be watching No One Lives! When I say that I'm like really nervous for this commentary, I'm really nervous. I'm a scaredy cat. I only like watching horror films with people because, you know, watching it alone will give me nightmares. If you guys haven't already like noticed, even in the last Halloween, like, or October commentaries that I've done, not a lot of them were really, really scary. And it's because I, I'm too scared to do it. <laughs> Fun fact though, in my last Twitch subathon, one of my top donator rewards of that stream was that they get to pick one of the movies that I get to commentate on, specifically a horror film for the month of October, and so this is why we're here. There's actually gonna be one more movie commentary that I'm gonna do that someone else has picked for me. This is one of them. I'm very nervous. I have no idea what this is about. I do think I remember someone in chat being like, oh my God, it's like a gory mess, which like, I'm really bad with gore. So this should be interesting. <laughs> Before we begin, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button if you haven't yet already so you can stay tuned to all my content. I post three times a week. Follow me on all my social media. All my handles will be in the description below. And follow me on Twitch. I live stream every Sunday, Tuesday, and Thursday. If you guys want to check out the full-length commentary to this movie, make sure you check out my Patreon page where you can gain full access to that and future movie slash TV shows that I do on this channel. Also, I'll be holding a Halloween subathon from October 30th to the 31st. It'll be 24 hours potentially long. <laughs> Anytime anyone subs or gifts or gives bits, it adds to the timer and then I have to keep the stream going as long as 24 hours. We're gonna have so many fun activities. I have two different costumes. It's gonna be such a fun time. Every year my Halloween subathon event is my favorite thing that I do. So if you guys haven't checked that out last year, Please join us this year. It's a lot of fun. Even if you aren't used to Twitch, I think we would love to have you on over. Also, if you're a part of Twitch, y'all better be there or else I'm coming after you. <laughs> All right, y'all, let's jump straight into the commentary. Ah! Oh, oh God, oh, oh, oh shoot, are you okay? We're in the woods. Oh my God, oh, she's a runner. Oh, I don't even wanna know what she's running from. Also, why are you only in like a tank top and underwear? <gasps> What did you just- Why is there random broken glass in the middle of the woods? Okay, shaky cam. Okay, not so shaky cam. What? 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 Who put a trap in the middle of the woods like this? Man, um, you know, I am really curious as to how you ended up in your underwear. And my guess is that you're not gonna make it because I don't think anyone lives in this movie. Just a guess. All right, so that was, okay, so who are these two? Sometimes it's necessary to relocate. Relocate? Y'all are moving? You have a truly demented way of looking at things. If I didn't, I don't think you'd be so in love with me. Oh, she says she likes a bad boy. She's into the ones that need to be fixed. I stopped somewhere for the night. For the night, it's like, you know, it's gotta be like 3 p.m. right now. You're talking to someone who's done a 4,000 mile cross country road trip. Like, I'm trying to freaking drive for at least 20 hours straight before I stop. <laughs> Just kidding. But also, like, totally not kidding. Oh my gosh, I literally drove for like 30 something hours straight. It was so bad. Eight sound to you. Infinity. I like it. Oh my god, of course. He's like all different. Can't just see eight as an eight. He has to say it's infinity. The FBI are scouring the area north of Spokane. From what we can tell, the carving is about six months old. Six months? That was six months ago? Clever girl. Now she has a chance. Okay, but also six months have passed, so I don't know if there's a chance no more. A lot can happen in six months. Take off the towel. Uh, Ma'am! Put the towel back up! Put the towel back up! I thought I was watching a horror film! Where'd you get that scar from? I'm sorry for everything. A man who lacks emotion is sorry. I just process it differently. Okay, mic drop. Okay, at least he's self-aware. I like normal. You like normal? Then why are you with him? Just tell me you don't love her more than me. I don't love her more than you. 
There's another girl? If you like normal, why are you with someone who has another girl? Okay, I'm definitely missing some information here. Oh, was the girl the one that went missing? Or am I completely off here? Jack, can you do me a favor and go to open the gate? Why? Because the gate won't open. I need you to open it, please. That was like the cringiest thing. Why is that like in the script? Why'd they pay the kid to have a line in the movie? Just open the damn gate! What? What? Why are you murdering people? Hello? That was so unnecessary. Oh my gosh, you just murdered a family. Excuse me for saving our f***ing asses. Flynn, you're an idiot. You're screwed. You just murdered a family. What do you mean save your asses? You're about to go down. I'm sorry. It's been like, what, 10 minutes? 15 minutes? Maybe less? The script is just interesting. I feel like they're really forcing the characters' personalities on to me using dialogue instead of just letting the actors do it. I'm hungry. I want to hear one word coming out of this actress mouth that isn't like this. And I want to hear a word coming out of her mouth that isn't like this. Sorry, wow, I'm so mean today. But also like, what am I watching? I don't think I've ever been this mean to a movie. Actually, sorry, false. Kung Fu Panda 3, I was pretty mean to the movie. Oh, Ned Z Classified School Survival Guide. Ned Z Classified School Survival Guide. Oh, this is the gang or burglars or whatever you guys are. I'm really not entirely sure. If I have to take any shit from you today, I'm gonna turn you ball sack into a bean. Bro, what? So cringe. I hate everything that's happening right now. I'm in pain. Hey, you guys from around here. Why are you talking to me? I think they're mutes. Please, we don't want any trouble. Well, just forget it, okay? Hey! If I wanted to hear from an asshole, I'd rip you a new one. Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. Cringe, that did not land! Don't mind my boy here. His idea of friendliness is to scare the tourists. <gasps> did he just say boo? He's like the most unintimidating, intimidating character. Same with that guy too. Boss man. <laughs> what the actual F? What do you even want? You guys are thieves, I'm assuming? What's your purpose? Why are you... Period. What the heck is happening right now? Where are we? Last place on earth. You know what? This is pretty funny. <laughs> so far, it hasn't been really horrifying more than it's been kind of cringy. I can't do this anymore. <laughs> That's the other girl? away from her get away she's dead she's de will you be get away from her she's dead she literally just killed herself i love how he is like i want normal and he's like okay you have to go it's a minute ah! oh, oh no 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 oh god it's so gory i don't know how much more i can take is this guy just gonna be on like a murderous rampage now like what is gonna happen that's a cool shot i like that shot can i get some Help here, please! It's too late for this f***ing shit, Flynn. What the f*** is that? Dude, she didn't even react to- she didn't even, like, stop acting! Ah, I don't know how to explain it, but the acting's not good. The script is whack. So far. So far. My hopes are up. My hopes are up. You killed him, Mike. Please tell me he's dead. Expand on he. The, the guy that you freaking took the car from. So this is the Emma girl? Why is she in like the same dress as the other girl? Please just call the police. Dude, you know, just like literally listen to this girl. Oh, but also this girl doesn't know that these people are also like not friendly with the police. So this is like all your fault, Flynn. Like now everyone's gonna get murdered because you just wanted to take a car that literally had nothing in it, actually, except for a girl. You know what, maybe you saved this girl's life. Flynn, you're kind of great. <laughs> Whoa. How are we, oh God, how did you miss that whole pool of blood? How did you miss the dead body on the floor? Oh, nobody kills Ethan. Well, I mean, you can only die once, sir. He really said nobody kills Ethan. It's fine, it's fine. I'm still holding up all right. I'm holding up all right. Why would you do that? 
why would you take off the thing that's around and soaked in blood? You're stupid. Whoa, so many scars. Do I even want to know what's been happening? Oh my god, no, I don't want to know. I don't want to know who the freaking guy is. It was like any other Friday night at the Oregon Arts Complex, except this celebration turned bloody. 14 students had been brutally murdered. Only one was never found. Emma Ward, the heiress to the Nashville-based Ward Publication Empire. The Ward family is offering a $2 million reward. Wow, $2 million? I mean, she is an heiress. You guys are about to get $2 million for returning this girl. You know, we're only here to help you, right? <laughs> yeah, girl! That's such BS, you kidding me? Here for her? You kidding me? They're trying to get the best possible outcome here. Where they're safe, where they get the most money. Forget about it. I would have reacted the same way. Okay, maybe I wouldn't have like conjured up saliva and then like shot it, but I would have been mad. I would have been like, uh, don't lie to me. What? Why the dramatic zoom in? Oh. You were not hiding inside of him. You were not. There's so much that just doesn't make sense with that. Huh? Oh my gosh. You are a mysterious man, sir. Oh, how was your swim? You feel all clean now? Good. I'm glad you're not choking in all that blood, you know? Oh, that's a butt. Sorry. Who is this man's? Watch this. If she moves, waste her. This, there's no logical reason why you should waste her. Boss man is so annoying. He's literally the worst character. I don't like him more than Flynn. <laughs> yeah! Yeah, that's what you get for being so dumb. Yeah, y'all are dead. Y'all are actually done so until Emma's the only one left. <laughs> Exploded the place. Yo, Emma's so chill. She's like, yeah, it's just another Tuesday. Oh, I don't even want to know. No way they're gonna. St I can't. Oh my god, I I can't watch this. I'm gonna literally get sick. You know, this character going is not the worst thing ever. I'm not. I can't watch the screen. I can't watch the screen because I will literally puke or pass out. You guys don't understand. I have a big phobia of blood. Even though I know that it's fake, I get really queasy. I have fainted while they were just taking like a little bit of blood out of me because I saw it and I just passed out. Any last words? Oh my god, no. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Oh my god, all of this for a girl? Like, why? Oh my god, this is so sick in the head. Oh, I can, I can still hear it. My headphones aren't even on and I can still hear it. Oh, ooh, ooh, crunches. Bone shattering, skull crushing, blood splattering. Okay, someone's literally trying to get me demonetized by watching this. The amount of covering and like blurring and bleeping that we gotta do in this video is probably unmatched to any other video that i've ever done what are the odds that this video is gonna be monetized like i think there's a higher chance of it being demonetized than monetized prisoners found in cages long after their captors surrendered actually cannibalized themselves you know what the technical term for that is sarcophagy i didn't need a vocabulary lesson sir when the arterial vein is sliced the body tends to bleed out within 10 minutes you're gonna use an exacto knife? You had a whole arsenal of weapons and you're gonna whip out the exacto knife? You know what? You really are a psychopath. Why are you telling me this? You now have the opportunity to save my life. <gasps> oh my god! What? The actual friggity fraggity is going on. So she had to save him because if he's not alive, then she wouldn't be able to get out. You, he's crazy. He's actually crazy. Why didn't he kill you? Because he loves me. What did he do to you? He did everything he possibly could with me, probably. Just because my old man was giving you the deep doesn't make you my mother. Oh! <laughs> oh! There's literal no time for this. Oh! <laughs> This is so extra. They really had a full blown fight where they're yeeting each other across the room, breaking tables, breaking mirrors or glass. I don't know. I wasn't really paying attention. Oh God, there's like literally not one character that I like, except for maybe Emma. Emma's fine. The killer's pretty cool too, I guess. I mean, he's a psychopath. Don't get me wrong. I'm not saying that I'm okay with his actions, but goddamn.
The people in this house are actually stupid. Oh my god, no way. Did you put the dad bits into a bag? No! Do not open that door. Just get the f*** out of my way. Let him open the door. Go interact with the bag. I want to see you. Touch it. Kick it. <laughs> oh god. Flynn is like literally the stupidest, stupidest person. Do you know what's funny? I was going to eat some food after this. There's no way. All of this has to be blurred out. Well, who wanted a commentary on this? I guess like this is what you wanted to see, right? Me freaking out and sweating and like, you know, being uncomfortable for an hour and a half. But also none of it can go in. Y'all use your imagination, YouTube cut. It's sloshy. It's gross. It's horrendous. I'm shamelessly closing my eyes. Y'all judge me in the comments all you want. You can make fun of me. You can say I'm a scaredy cat. Do what you give me your worst. I will close my eyes. I will take my headphones off and I will crawl into a ball and go into the corner and cry. Y'all are actually done so. The killer is going to come for you and probably kill you in really weird ways. Oh my god! Oh my god, what is he using? Did you not see him just standing there? There's no way that you're not seeing him in there. Oh my god! Where did he even come from? That's like half the funny part about this comedy movie, right? You never really know why anything happens. It's just is. <laughs> Yo, you got some good aim, bro. I was like, you know, just another night. Oh, he's still awake! Are you killing him? Wait, get the Oh, look thing. at him! You think we're doing him a favor? He was gonna kill him. He was gonna kill him. He was gonna be like, look at him, he's already dead. Even though he's fully breathing, like, what? Why are you doing this? Keeps me fit. Keeps me fit! It keeps me fit, he said! He says my workout for the day! I can't believe that's what he said. The fact that you're even able to, like, crawl is incredible. Why don't you turn your lights on, trigger him? You said I was asking for your opinion. Well, we've come this far. It would be nice to actually live. But the thing is, no one's gonna live. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, you're literally just gonna plop him in front of the hospital? <laughs> Thanks for honking the horn. Really assuring my life there. Hey, dude, did you get an accident or something? Do, do you need a ride? You're gonna give... The guy covered in blood? A ride? Never give strange people rides, please. All of y'all are dead. Who knows, maybe even the psychopath is gonna die. He'll probably end himself as well. Here's my prediction. Emma's gonna die, and then he's gonna have, like, no purpose to live. I got 15 rooms all with your name on it. Just one, thanks. Who you calling? Hello, Sheriff. This is Harris. Uh, you called the Sheriff? I'm gonna take you straight to your daddy. But I think you're worth more than two million dollars. I think you're worth at least five. So you're gonna bargain with the dad? That's why you're taking her all the way home? Cause you're like, you know what? I'll give her, give your daughter back to you with added the goodness of my heart, but also give me more money. I'm not a criminal by the way, but also give me more money. <laughs> Gun's right there. What? So you kill him. I don't want to find out that I can't. Um, but also, like, you are in a motel with, like, people around. So, like, why would you just kill people? Also, like, I'm so sorry. But whoever that woman is, like, why did she make s 10 different poses? She's, like, on the wall and, like, she's <laughs> really trying to make everything about her shower super sexy. Like, it really ain't. You saved my life, Emma. I saved you to save myself. Did you search me for a key? There was no key. Because there was no lock. No actual way. It wasn't locked? The door wasn't locked? He literally gaslit her to think that like the door was locked and that he was the only way out so that she would save him. And then she saved him and now he has this sick twisted thought in his head thinking that she likes him or something, right? Ew, ew. Don't say a word. Flynn, you're like the opposite of intimidating. You're just gross. You're like the equivalent of bad airplane food. You're just gross. You know, that's a really interesting way to climb through a window. Oh, oh, go oh God, oh man, what? Oh jeez, I did not need to see that. Is she dead? Is she gone, Earth? No way. Of 
course. No way you just killed the sheriff. You're arguably crazier than the other dude. Where's this movie going, to be honest? Hey! Turn around! Loki, I'm glad this guy saved your ass. Okay, even though he's a crazy poo poo pants. Stop all your ammo. Ah! Oh. Yo, 10 out of 10. Give me one of those boards that I could write a 10. Yo, she yeeted out that window like in Scott Pilgrim. Oh, yes, Emma, you got this. No one lives except for you. I can sense it. I can feel it. Of course. Of course, he's like on the random pile of junk. How did he get up there? No one knows. Where does he come from? No one knows. He can just teleport. I'm assuming he has magical powers. <laughs> Owie? Okay, yes, girl. Are, oh, in the knees? <laughs> he saved her? Also, you just had a bulletproof vest on? But like, I get it, I guess. You did have time to prep. <laughs> Sorry, Flynn. Like, you're definitely done, so. Where did that ditch come from? You know what? Okay. It's not the craziest thing I've seen. <laughs> yes, Emma. We have something special. Are you out of your mind? I'm very much in my mind. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. There's no way he just said that. That was the script. That was the line you gave him. I'm very much in my mind. You can't kill me, Emma. Gosh, why? Why? Oh no! What is inside her? Was that like a tracker? So confused. Huh? <laughs> oh! It's just a cherry on top! Oh, he was so nice to him before, too. Oh gosh. Why did he have a tracker in her? I don't want to know. I don't actually care. Oh, Danny's alive, though. Hey, man. Oh, my God. Of course, he's a doctor. Ooh, the heart monitor going up a little bit. Incredible. No one lives. Wow, you must be strong if you could do that with a clipboard. Was that like the finale? Okay, no one lives except for Emma. Unless she died. Did she die? <laughs> I don't even know. And it seems that Emma Ward was the victim of a kidnapping. Oh, so Emma was found! And apparently there's a lot of press trying to look at her. They're acting like paparazzi, which is like probably not what would happen in a scene like this is so unbelievable. Wait, no way. No way, that's the end of the movie. That's, that's it. Please excuse me while I contemplate my entire existence. did i just watch this is just a stupid movie it's so gory well i guess the only thing this movie really got going for it was like the effects everything else kind of sucked what are the reviews on this movie hold on there's no way it got 48 percent on rotten tomatoes this should have a zero box office seventy four thousand dollars. budget 2.9 million that was no one lives um i don't think i have a real outro for this that was horrible it was so bad. Such a bad movie. Thanks so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed that commentary, make sure to leave it a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't yet already so you can stay tuned to all my content. And don't forget to check out my last video. If you guys want to check out the full length commentary to this movie, then you should check out my Patreon page. Watch this full length and previous full lengths. Alrighty guys, I have the business day ever. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye! Okay, bye, okay, bye, okay, bye! <laughs>